Hendricks winds and delivers. Back up the middle, picked up by the short stop and not able to hang on to it was Nichols. Throw to the plate is not in time. Everybody's gonna advance. Dolan bases and with errors like that on the pitcher. As Gordon goes right back up the middle, hits off the second base bag. This is gonna be a single and an RBI. Sarah Gordon continues to rake in the batter's box. She swings, sends it to right center field, going back in, it's gone, right on cue. Taylor Roby launches another home run and Roby makes this game three to nothing, her 12th home run of the season. Puts a runner in scoring position with the count two and one here to Lotus. Lotus swings, lifts it into center, dives and no, but picking it up, throwing it to second as Hassos couldn't get to it in time. An RBI single for Easton Lotus. You break up the easy double play. Run on, swing in a shot to center. Two runs coming in and they're good. Trying to take care of second was Clyde. It gets by, she's gonna go all the way to third. Clyde rounding the bases. She's gonna come all the way home and it is a one run game 4-3 is our score a couple of errors from the Cardinals and Syracuse has made it a game once again you have room to work with with a 1-2 count so maybe put it a little bit inside back up the middle needing a play from their shortstop Breen Breen throw is not in time and it's going to be an E6 and a run scored for Louisville they extend their lead up to two runs now it's a 5-3 ball game Alve swings, pops it up. Is it gonna have enough room to play? They do, and the catcher, Sarah Gordon, makes the final out. Louisville will win this game by a score of five to three. It's the team in ERA. As she deals, and Roby skies that one out to center. Going back to center fielder, Hasso, and it's gone. Taylor Roby picks up right where she left off in game one and matches her home run total. Second of the day, first of game number two. About 13th of the year, and Louisville takes a two to nothing lead in the top of the first inning. That's with your timing. Zabala ready, the one two as Lopez lifts this one into shallow center field. On to it is Corby Otis who drops it. Lopez. Will be in there thanks to an E8 and maybe a little help from the sun. The pitch from Zabala popped up inside the first base line, and Hannah File comes in to make the catch and end the inning. A runner left stranded on second. We go to the second. A one two punch like that. Should win you some games as long as the bats are moving, but the bats are moving for the Cardinals and Allie Alexander as she slaps that pitch into left field. And a runner on to start off the top of the second inning for Louisville. Whether that's starting or pinch running as she turns on one towards second, it goes off the hand of Nichols into right field. The throw on down to third in time. What a throw from Madeline Lopez. Nichols pokes it toward the first base side and File makes the catch. After two innings, Louisville still with the lead. It's 2-0 Cardinals on the season. The 1-2 to Sarah Gordon. Rips that one out towards center. Back to center fielder, it's out of here. Sarah Gordon doubles the score line, makes it four to nothing, Cardinals. She has a home run in two of her last three games and her fifth on the year. And Louisville up four to nothing in the fourth inning. Bo on first, the pitch from Zabala. 
Golf toward second base. Easy play for Lotus to end the inning. I'd be willing to say that. I think Jenny Finch is definitely the greatest. It's a safe call. The 3-0 misses eight straight balls. Called by the home plate umpire and delivered by Syracuse pitchers. As Kaya Oliver will now have to face the most dangerous hitter in this lineup in the circle. Delivers, Roby belts this one out to center, turning, looking, goodbye. Wow. Do it yourself, Taylor Roby. Taylor Roby is grand, a grand slam for Roby. And the Louisville Cardinals double their lead, make it eight nothing for the red and black. Sky Top Stadium, Holloway delivers, strike three, swing and a miss. And that'll do it as the Louisville Cardinals come away with two wins in the doubleheader. A 5-3 victory, now an 8-0 victory here in game number two. Final lines for Louisville. Eight runs, five hits, and an error for Syracuse. It's no runs, one hit, and three errors. The winning pitcher, Alyssa Zabala. The losing pitcher, Madison Knights.